All right, kids, today we've got some more Pizzeria Simulator bootlegs to look at because that was one of my favorite video games. And when it comes to Pizzeria Simulator and Funko, well, unfortunately, they have only made like six figures. So if you want other figures besides these guys right here, well, you have to turn to the Mexican bootlegs to get characters like this one right here, good old Happy Frog, as well as a bunch of others that we just picked up. And oh man, some of these you have to see to believe because they are off the ball bonkers. All right, so the first one we get is, all right, Mr. Hippo. And this is a figure I wish we really gotten by Funko because he's such a cool character in the articulated form. But here is the Mexican bootleg of Mr. Hippo. I gotta say, wow, they did a great job on this guy. Looks just like him with all the uh, pool shade of purple. See, look at that. Ah, oh, so cool. So yeah, I like the purple they used for him. And just like the other Mexican bootlegs, it has all kinds of cool articulation in the head, the arms. Let's see, the legs don't move. Oh, that's a first. And the torso does though. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And then, I wonder if his face comes off because they always make these, uh, come. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, I didn't expect to do that. Oh man, his, his snout comes off? Oh, that's funny. Let's see, uh, I know the face comes off though. Uh, and, oh, crazy. So yeah, there's the jump scare, Mr. Hippo. <laughs> oh, that is gross. Oh man, look at those rows of teeth underneath there. Where if the top hat comes off? And yep, it does. Cool, so let's put that back on because it looks darn creepy without it. <laughs> oh, brother. And then on the back, ooh, we get that signature light to light him up. So, yeah, check it out. We can see him lighting up through his, uh, let's see, I guess this comes off too? Oh, man, oh, could give me a seizure with that blinking light, but uh, let's put that back on. So, yeah, we get the uh, strobe light effect underneath his torso there. Cool, so there's Mr. Hippo that you can only find in Mexico in bootleg form. Now let's see, put him up next to Happy Frog. Well, these guys look really cool together. Nice! Oh man, I wish Funko made these two guys in articulated form. Oh, what a missed opportunity. All right, so let's move along and see who we get this time. And, ooh, is this Helpy? Oh, let's see, this is, uh, wait a minute. What is this, Rockstar Funtime Freddy? <laughs> oh, that is so crazy. Oh, this is exactly why I love reviewing these bootlegs, because <laughs> they even make up their own characters. Oh, that crazy. So yeah, there is Rockstar Funtime Freddy. <laughs> is it cool or what? So it looks like they took Rockstar Freddy here and merged them with Funtime Freddy, put them together, and this is what you got. Funtime Rockstar Freddy. <laughs> oh, cool. And you can tell because he's got that star on his chest, and he has all the same colors as Funtime Freddy. Cool, so let's check a look at his face here, because, I mean, even though they made him his own figure, the execution is actually pretty good. His ears here, that's great. They used all kinds of pinks and purples for that. Even the microphone is a light pastel color, so that's pretty cool, too. And, yeah, down to his feet, which, cool, they got the pink, uh, wait a minute, these come off? <laughs> oh, man, oh, that's so cool, these come off, too. Wow. <laughs> you never know what you're gonna find with these bootlegs. Oh, that's so funny. Let's see, I know the face cup. Oh man, the snout comes off for this guy. <laughs> Why do they have the snout removable? Oh my gosh, that's so funny. So let's see, let's take the face off. And there's the jump scare, fun time, rock star. Wait a minute, oh, this comes off too? Ah! <laughs> oh man, I'm just uh, doubling over and laughter. Look at those eyes. Oh boy, that is super creepy. So I wonder if we put the top layer on with those eyeballs. Oh, now that is creepy-tastic. Look at that. And that's his face. <laughs> oh, crazy funny. So boy, that is really clever, I gotta say, even though it's funny. Let's see, let's press the button. And yeah, there we go. Get a little more light up action. More than uh, Mr. Hippo here. Yeah, like before, you get three different rounds of Light up features, cool. Let's fix his face here. So he's back to normal, and ta-da! Rockstar Funtime Freddy! <laughs> what a great idea. Oh, that's funny. And let's see, if we go back to the box here, let's see, we got one more figure from this lineup, and oh, that's Ballora, but wait a minute. Is that a Funtime Ballora? <laughs> oh, yeah, it is a Funtime Ballora. Check that out. Because Ballora usually has colors of purples and dark blue purples, and this one, Nope, you don't see any of that on this one. 
you just see all kinds of pinks and purples, just like with the uh, Funtime Freddy here. So that is her normal pose with the face, and of course it is a bootleg, so it's not gonna look perfect. Oh, brother. So yeah, let's see, the, the body is pretty much the same. We've got the uh, Funtime colors all over her. Cool with the purple skirt. These colors even reach down onto her legs. Yep, she kind of dances around. Dude, I'm a ballerina! Ah, <laughs> cool. And the one awesome thing about this feature that I just love about Mexican bootlegs is they all have that jump scare pose to their face. So let, oh man, oh, if I don't break it first. Oh man, oh, it's all falling apart. Boo, <laughs> oh brother. Okay, so there's the first layer of the face coming at you. Oh man, I wish these pieces could have like hinged off there, but the thing is made too cheaply to do that. Oh, gross. But yeah, it looks like a Terminator or something. <laughs> All right, so let's pull this up, and there's nothing left. <laughs> Why did they even make that a second layer? Oh, there's nothing there. Ugh, gross. Well, anyway, there is the crazy blur with, let's see, light up body. And yeah, since it's just a white paint on this girl, ugh, a creepy jump scare blur ditching her way across the screen. And of course, the last one here is based off the new game, Pizzeria Simulator. Oh, man. And the figure we have is good old Lefty, which is a fan favorite from that game. Oh man, for being a bootleg, this guy looks amazing. It looks just like Lefty from the game. Oh man, incredible. Now this bootleg comes with two accessories, which is a top hat and a microphone. Well, that's cool. We can put the top hat up here, but of course, there's no way to secure it on. So if you tip him over, ah, it's just gonna fall. Oh man, what an amazing looking bootleg. Now, I usually don't like bootleg figures, but this one is just incredible. I mean, look at the way his mouth opens. Oh, I gotta love that. And that looks just like he does from the game too. And if you're wondering if Full Lefty has a faceplate, well, yes he does. And we'll take that off now, revealing. <laughs> ah, look at that. Oh, gross. Yeah, he's got those little eyeballs that are popping out. Oh, I love it. And of course, the last feature we're gonna look at is if you turn this guy around, and press this button here. <laughs> oh, he goes up in the face. Oh man, that's cool. Let's see what it looks like without the faceplate on. Oh man, that is just awesome. All right, kids, with that, we now have three bootlegs coming at you. Some we know and others that we don't know. <laughs> and of course, now we can put these together with our other Pizzeria Simulator bootlegs for one big old family from Pizzeria Simulator. <laughs> oh, is that cool or what? Now, if you want any of these characters for your video, make sure you check out eBay because that's where I've been finding them. And just be careful, kids, because if you smell these things, ugh, they don't smell too good, so I don't think they're made with the safest of plastics. So purchase at your own risk. Ugh. So, all right, Freddy Nights at Freddy's fans, make sure you subscribe because we've got some more Five Nights at Freddy's stuff coming to you in the near future.